Sorry, guys, for the hiccups. Hey, it's here, the Vaping Guy. Here to finish off the reviews on the Stomp Bumper Juices, I have uh, three more juices to do. I've got Long Island Iced Tea, Turk Turk, and Island Frost. I'm going to start off with the Long Island Iced Tea. The bottle's right here. I don't know if you can see. Right there. Long Island Iced Tea. And this is a Stomp Puffers Potions. All right. Um, this is going to be a hard one because I have never actually drank a Long Island iced tea, which is an alcoholic drink for those of you who know. Um, it's never been something I've ever desired. Again, I have a cat interrupting. Scoot, scoot, scoot. Get, get. Um, so I have no basis of, of evaluation. Um, it's never been a drink I've been interested in trying. You know, it's like... I don't know, it's like a Cosmo, I've never had a Cosmo. So I, I have nothing to, to compare this against. So if this ends up tasting absolutely nothing like it, then it tastes nothing like it. Um, there's an alcoholic basis there. That, that effervescence, uh, you know, like a champagne-y kind of thing. There's definitely lemon. I don't know, um, some sort of a, uh, like maybe a cola product or something. The big things I can taste is, is the alcohol, that alcoholic uh, kick, and, and the lemon are the big things, but there is an underlying, I'm calling it like a, like a cola or maybe like a root beer or probably tastes like, it, it's probably iced tea itself. I don't know, Long Island iced tea I'm assuming has like, Lifted iced tea and alcohol and lemon in it. Something like that, maybe. I don't know. I've never, like I said, I, don't, I have no idea. But yeah, there's a tea. Now that I'm thinking, there's a tea note to it. I think there's a tea note. It's. And it's not bad at all. Um, I'm not a huge, grand fan of the alcoholic vapes, generally speaking. Um, I find that they end up being a little bit on the perfumey side. This is, there's hardly anything there to it when it comes to the perfume side. I'm just going to top up because I'm going dry. There we go. Yeah, like it, there's a lemon iced tea there, I think. Um, some sort of an alcoholic, and yeah, that that's it. So um, I can't say anything beyond that because I really just don't have any basis of comparison. I can't sit there and go, oh yeah, I've had I've either a had a Long Island iced tea or I've made one, so I know what's in it. Um, and it's one of those flavors that it's there's no distinct. There's a little bit of a lemon kick out. But there's no one flavor that's distinct. Um, I'm under no disbelief. I've, I've had other people tell me that it tastes very good. I've got an itchy eye now. Ah! And I had juice on the eye. Oh! <laughs> Ooh, that hurts. I had juice on that finger, I think. I just rubbed it in my eye. <laughs> it's a little burny. Ooh. All right, so you get two things out of this. You get to, to try uh, get to get my impressions on the uh, Style and Puppers potions, Long Island iced tea, and you've uh, seen real time. Uh, oh, that burns! Oh, don't open the eye. Uh, what a uh, what an idiot looks like when they stick juice in their thing in their eye. E juice has nicotine and blah 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 in it. It's not meant for your eyes. <laughs> Anyways, it's Jay the One-Eyed Vaping Guy, signing off.